So KSP2 is finally out, but there is still a lot of people asking how to fix their wings, saying they won't stop flapping or they just can't get them under control. So I decided to make this video to explain very simply how to set your wings to even glide through the air. So at this point, you'll be able to walk away and make yourself a cup of coffee while your Kerbal can fly to another continent. I've included the sped up footage of me building the jumbo jet I'll be using to explain later in this video. So once you've got your plane ready to go, and on the runway, you'll notice that SAS is already switched on. I left this on in the video just to demonstrate how the wings react. Straight away, I right click one of the wings, select deploy, and I then bring the deploy angle down to zero. This will bring the wings in a neutral position. I then go ahead and select advanced controls. From here, you get to set your authority limiter. And what this does is it limits the movement of SAS. So whenever you do have SAS selected, it doesn't go as floppy. I normally recommend an authority limiter about 5 to 9 degrees whenever you just want to get off the ground safely. Next you're going to want to unbrake. Start your engines, get to a nice speed. Start to pull up. If you're not pulling up as much as you like, then turn up your authority limiter until you have the incline that you want. I start playing with the deploy angle and as you can see naturally my plane starts to point up 
and with SAS enabled, I'm able to just glide through the air. Also make sure to have your authority limiter about 1 to 3 degrees if you're going to be walking away. Time warp as well works really well with larger crafts. I've actually noticed in my time in building planes that the bigger the plane, the less the bugs that you're going to run into. Please do like and subscribe, it'll help me out in the future, and you'll be able to keep up to date with my Kerbal Space Program content. Much appreciated, thanks.